This is our story, a Tottenham tale. From Turnpike Lane to the village of Hale. A blend of cultures living side by side, striving for a future, never shying from pride. Tottenham has always had a long history of protest because this has been one of the poorest outer London boroughs for a long time. Interesting place. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it for a holiday. Beware the anger of a patient man. I don't feel safe walking about, no. especially in the evening. There don't seem to be any togetherness now. There seems to be a volcano of hatred. Yeah, violence, everyone is into it nowadays. I feel like it's getting worse. I don't, I don't think it's getting better. Of course we get violence on the streets and things because we've ceased to care about our community. Kids, they don't really uh, have any other options in this area. No one gives a shit about them and they're left to their own devices and the only people they can look up to are the dealers and the gangsters. I've known Tottenham for a long time. It has its ups and downs. I mean, it's still a bit rough, <laughs> but it's changing a lot. You can say it's gentrification. We had eight community centres that all got knocked down in order to be sites for these high rises. There's nowhere for the kids to go. I think it's great that the regeneration's happening, but at what cost, I'm not sure. They're trying to cash in on the creativity that's in the area without supporting it. There's two clusters now. <laughs> There's an academic opinion on sort of social cleansing, people being moved out of the borough as part of regeneration projects. Justification would be alright if they didn't push out all the original inhabitants of the area. Keep staying up pulling over. What to do, you're going to screw your lay, your play, your slayer. In Tottenham, we need to believe in ourselves, believe in our neighbourhood, believe in our tradition, believe in our humanity. If you look at the quality of Tottenham, the wonderful people here, most of them don't have any money, but they're punching way above their weight. This borough is full of talent. There's very, very talented young people here. A lot of it is just misdirected or dormant. If you can't afford to go to Spurs, and that's the majority of people that live in Tottenham, we give them free football. The thing that keeps me here is the different cultures and, and just the, the tapestry that is this area of, of Tottenham. It's, just, it's, it's, it's really nice. Do I reflect the system, or does the system reflect me? Why do I feel trapped when I'm supposed to be free? The iconic people we meet and see. People, please, believe in me. The journey is long and the vision wide. No fear is the answer, but please decide. A lamb's bleat is often more telling than a dog's bark. The tales we go on forevermore. Please don't forget the skill of the poor.